happening? I'm heading to New York. What up, peeps? Today is the big day. I am moving to New York right now. I'm on my way. I am excited. I'm nervous, scared. I have like a semi plan, but not an official plan. I have one night in a hotel as of today and then I'm going to figure it out from there. My plan is to kind of like stay in different neighborhoods until I discover which one I want to settle down in and then I will get an apartment or, you know, find a longer term living space. Just a girl with a dream. The only thing though, it's like a cloudy day. I think it might rain soon. It's okay. It's almost like it's expressing my emotions because when I started the drive, it was really sunny and now it's getting a little gloomy and, and darker. I literally feel every single emotion throughout this whole process. I'm like excited, nervous, scared, sad, happy. I feel everything. I'm already getting that exciting feeling that I get every single time that I come to New York. This is reminding me right now at this moment why I wanted to do this and why I had to do this as a big move and step in my life because I just I had this feeling that's like so good every time I get here. I'm really excited right now. <laughs> God, we made it to our first hotel the first night. Cats are here. I'm gonna let them out so they can explore and see where they are. Come on, Nyla. <laughs> Come on. Oh, hi, buddy. That was like a little over two hour ride. So here we are in our first hotel. Look at them. <laughs> Heading right to the big window. Ooh, this is beautiful. Wow, I love the view. I'm currently like parked right, I think that might be my car and I I think I forgot to lock it. I hope this works. <laughs> Hi, Nat. Boop, boop. Are they under the bed? Ew, there's a piece of popcorn under there. Are you already inspecting the bathroom, Bambo? I have no idea where I am, but I'm exploring. So I'm meeting my cousin who has a place that I might stay at. I just don't know if I'm gonna like the location. I'm in Chinatown right now, just got here. So I hope the cats are adjusting. I think they're fine. Cause I had to stay in Philly hotels for a little bit after I moved out and they were adjusting. And I think they loved it. They were excited every time we moved the hotel. Oh, this is so exciting. How cool is that? My first day here, there's a beautiful rainbow. This is gonna sound really dumb, but rainbows are so cool. <laughs> like, how? I haven't seen a rainbow in years, honestly. I forgot about them. <laughs> I don't know how much you guys would wanna see of my journey as far as like Turn left exactly what I'm street. doing or me telling you what I did do. So keep me updated on what I, oh my God. <gasps> That's so funny. I just found the tea store. That's so random. I love the tea at this, this company has really good tea and I just saw the store. Wow, is that tea mounds? Mounds of tea, hold on. I don't know if that's mounds of tea, I guess it is. Wow, but that company makes very good tea and I didn't know they had a store in New York, but everything is in New York. Anyway, I was just gonna say, I don't know how much guys want to see of what I am actually doing versus what I have done and then I just tell you about it. I ended up meeting my cousin who I pretty much haven't seen in years and it was great to see him and we just had like dinner and he showed me a really cool speakeasy. It was closed but one day I will absolutely go there and film it because it was like really cool shady fun vibe. So funny like you would never think this is speak easy as you walk by. I want to show you guys whenever I make it there. I'm loving New York even though it's raining. That's how you know you like somewhere or a day and night and evening 
is when you're in the rain and you're enjoying it just because. This literally speaks volume to me right now in this moment and I am really happy that I just saw the sign. It's crazy. I believe it. I can't even describe how happy I am right now. It's my first night in New York, still homeless, no place to live. I just have one night booked in a hotel. I don't know where the hell I'm going. I don't have an exact plan, but I am so happy with this decision right now. I'm just walking in the rain to go back to my hotel by myself. It's already midnight, but I love this. <laughs> I pick up on little things all the time, like little signs. To me, like this is the weirdest thing. Not not weird, it's just so meaningful to me when I see things right at the perfect moment, like the other sign that I had just seen. I walked a couple blocks further and I was just saying to myself, I don't know the path that I'm going on, but I'm like writing my story. I'm enjoying this. Look at what I just found. How crazy is this? The timing of me seeing this and thinking what I just thought, this bear is literally on a path and he's writing his own story, his path. And then it says, stay forever young. That's like the attitude that I basically live by. I was actually admiring this entire wall. I love stuff like this. And then I took notice closely to the artwork and I was like, whoa, that's crazy. That too, I like that too. Back home. Wait, did you just, she just came from under the bed. I'm home for the night. I got my shoes all dirty. I just cleaned them too. They were like so fresh and now they're destroyed. We're so happy. <laughs> Come here, sweetie. Hi, pretty. Look how chubby Nyla is. She's so happy in the shower. Of course, he drops all the stuff. I was just peeing. <laughs> I had to stop to end this video. <laughs>